Hello, I'm Sue Cooper and this is a general English presentation for E2 English and Environment. Today we will look at the present perfect tense using nominal sentences. Let's compare the form of the simple past with the form of the present perfect. The simple past uses was or were. I was a teacher. You were smart. He was at home. We were students. The present perfect uses has been or have been. I have been a teacher. You have been smart. He has been at home. We have been students. Let's compare the function of the simple past with the present perfect. The simple past is for past events that are now finished. I was a student last year, but not now. You were happy a few minutes ago, but not now. He was at Sarah's house every day, but not now. The present perfect is for past events that continue to be true now or are connected to now. I have been a student this year. I maybe still am. You have been happy this week. You maybe still are. He has been at Sarah's house today. He maybe still is. The present perfect is often used with time signals that start in the past and are still true in the present. Repeat these examples of present perfect positive sentences. I have been active today. You have been a teacher for five years. He has been in the garden for three hours. We have been hard working all our lives. They have been farmers since 2002. She has been at home since Tuesday. The present perfect is also often used with adverbs of time. This causes the word order to change. Repeat these examples of present perfect positive sentences with adverbs of time. I have often been active. You have already been a teacher. He has just been in the garden. We have usually been hard working. They have always been farmers. She has sometimes been at home. Okay, back to present perfect nominal sentences. Let's look at the negative form with time signals. To create negative sentences, we must add the word not. Have not been, have not been, has not been, have not been, have not been, has not been. Repeat these examples of present perfect negative sentences. I have not been active today. You have not been a teacher for five years. He has not been in the garden for three hours. We have not been hard working all our lives. They have not been farmers since 2002. She has not been at home since Tuesday. 
Well done. So how about present perfect nominal sentences, negative form, with adverbs of time? Usually, we must add the word not plus the adverb of time. Have not usually been. Have not always been. Has not just been. Have sometimes not been. Have never been. Has rarely been. Not is after the word sometimes and not before it. Negative adverbs like never and rarely don't need not. Repeat these examples of present perfect negative sentences. I have not usually been active. You have not always been a teacher. He has not just been in the garden. We have sometimes not been lazy. They have never been farmers. She has rarely been at home. Awesome! Challenge for a prize. Write these sentences in the correct word order. You can do it in the comments section under this video. Let's look at the present perfect interrogative form. To change positive sentences into interrogative sentences, we must move has or have to the beginning of the sentence. Have I been active today? Have you been a teacher for five years? Has he been in the garden for three hours? Have we been hard working all our lives? Have they been farmers since 2002? Has she been at home since Tuesday? Repeat the sentences. Have I been active today? Have you been a teacher for five years? Has he been in the garden for three hours? Have we been hard working all our lives? Have they been farmers since 2002? Has she been at home since Tuesday? To change present perfect positive sentences with adverbs of time into the interrogative form, again, we must move has or have to the beginning of the sentence. Have I often been active? Have you already been a teacher? Has he just been in the garden? Have we usually been lazy? Have they always been farmers? Has she sometimes been at home? Repeat these examples of present perfect interrogative sentences. Have I often been active? Have you already been a teacher? Has he just been in the garden? Have we usually been lazy? 
Have they always been farmers? Has she sometimes been at home? Repeat these present perfect positive form sentences. One, Dana has been the best student today. Two, Jason and Tim have been in the library since 2 p.m. Three, I have never been hard working. Four, you have been enthusiastic today. Five, my father has usually been an inspiring person. Did you get them right? Read them again. Well done. Repeat these present perfect negative form sentences. One, Jason and Tim have not been enthusiastic since 2 p.m. Two, Dana has not been in the library this year. Three, I have never been an inspiring person. Four, my father has not been hard working today. Five, you have not usually been the best student. Did you get them right? Read them again. Well done. Repeat these present perfect interrogative form sentences. One. Have you never been in the library? Two, has Dana been an inspiring person this year? Three, have Jason and Tim usually been hardworking? Four, have I been the best student since 2 p.m.? Five, has my father been enthusiastic today? Did you get them right? Read them again. Well done. In this video, we studied the present per perfect nominal sentences with time signals and adverbs of time. Check out the next E2 video about present perfect verbal sentences. This was a en general English presentation by Sue Cooper for E2 English and Environment. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you next time. Sampai jumpa.